Hi everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to make this raccoon lovey. So I'll leave a link in the description for the star blanket and the hexagon. You can use either one and um, how to crochet the arms. Okay, so all you're going to need is some cotton yarn in white, black and grey. A yarn needle, a 3mm hook, a pair of scissors and some stuffing. To start, take your black cotton yarn, make a slip knot, chain two, and then make six single crochets in the first chain that you made. Pull the tail tight. And then in the next row, we're just going to single crochet around. So one in each stitch. Okay, so you should still have six single crochets around. For the next row, we're going to increase to 12, but we need to change from black to white. So go into the next stitch and make a slip stitch with the white. and then knot the two ends together okay so once you've knotted the two ends together cut your black yarn and then you want to chain one and make two single crochets in the same stitch that you slip stitched into and then two single crochets in each stitch around Okay, once you've increased to 12, you just want to do one row of single crochet. So just one in each stitch. Okay, after that row we need to increase to 18. 
one single crochet in the first stitch, one increase in the second stitch. Okay, so it increases two single crochets in the same stitch. So just do that all the way back to the stitch marker, one single crochet, one increase in the next stitch. Okay, now that we've increased to 18, in the next row we're going to change to grey. So, slip stitch to the next stitch. So, insert your hook, change to grey. And pull it through. Okay, knot the two ends together and cut the white yarn. So for this row we just want a single crochet around. So chain one, put one single crochet in the same stitch that you slip stitched into. And then one in each stitch. So at the end of this row, you should still have 18. Okay, once you've single crocheted around for 18 stitches, in the next row you want to increase to 24. So one single crochet in the first stitch, one single crochet in the second stitch, and one increase in the third stitch. Okay, so two single crochets and an increase. Okay, once you've increased to 24, and in the next row we're going to increase to 30. So, three single crochets. And an increase.
Okay, so just do that until you get back to your stitch marker. Okay, once you've increased to 30, in the next row we're going to increase to 36. So, four single crochets. And an increase. Okay, so that's how it looks once you've increased to 36. So next we're just going to do 5 rows of single crochet. So just 1 in each stitch for 5 rows. Okay. Okay, so I'll stop the video here and I'll do my five rows and come back and show you how it looks. Okay, so here's how it looks after my five rows. All right. In the next row we're going to start to decrease. So we're going to go from 36 to 30. So single crochet four. And then make a decrease. So go through the front loop of the first stitch, the front loop of the second stitch, yarn over and pull through those two loops, yarn over and pull through the last two. Okay, so four single crochets and a decrease until you get back to the stitch marker. Okay, so a decrease is the front loop of the first stitch, 
front loop of the second stitch, yarn over and pull through the first two, yarn over and pull through the last two. Okay, once you've decreased down to 30, you just want to do one row of single crochet. So just one in each stitch for one row. Okay, so once you've single crocheted around, in the next row we're going to decrease to 24. So single crochet three and a decrease. Okay, three single crochets and a decrease until you get back to the stitch marker. Okay, once you've finished decreasing down to 24, in the next row we're going to decrease to 18. So single crochet 2. And a decrease. Okay, two single crochets and a decrease until you're back at the stitch marker. Okay, so once I finish decreasing down to 18, I've stuffed it. And the next row you want to decrease to 12. So one single crochet. And one decrease. Okay, you want to do that until you get back to the stitch marker. One single crochet and one decrease. Okay, once you've decreased down to 12, and the last row you want to decrease every stitch so you'll go from 12 single crochets to six so it's just six decreases Okay, once you've decreased down to six, you want to cut your yarn long enough to stitch it onto the blanket. Uh, pull it through. And 
and then you just want to weave the tail through the front loops of each of the last six stitches. Okay, and pull the tail tight. Okay, next you want to make the eyes. So take your black cotton yarn make a slip knot chain four then you want to skip the last chain that you made and put one single crochet in each stitch so you should have three single crochets For the next row, chain one and turn. And then you want to put one increase in each of the three stitches. So that's two single crochets in each stitch. So at the end of this row, you should have six single crochets. For the next row you want to change to white so chain one with your white and turn and then you want to make one single crochet in each stitch Okay, and then you just want to chain one and you want to cut your white and black long enough to stitch it on okay next I'm going to make the ears so take your gray yarn make a slip knot chain four skip the last chain that you made make one single crochet in the next stitch one single crochet in the next one and then in this last stitch make three single crochets all in the same stitch Okay, then you need to turn and work in the back of the chain. You want to make two single crochets. Okay. 
me. One in there and one in the next one. Then you want to slip stitch to the start and change to white. Okay, knot the two ends together. And then you can cut the grey long enough to stitch it on. Next you want a single crochet three. One in each stitch. Okay. And this next stitch. We're going to single crochet one, chain one, and another single crochet in the same stitch. Next, you want to single crochet three, one in each stitch. Chain one and turn. You want to single crochet four, one in each stitch. Chain two. And single crochet four. Okay, chain one, and then you can cut your yarn. Okay, and to stitch on the eyes. I do it right on this white line and I have the widest side on the center in the center okay and I leave a little gap in the middle as well Okay, so I stitched on, I used the black tail to stitch on along here. And then I used the white tail to stitch along the top and make these little eyes. And then I stitched the ears about five rows back. Okay, two stitches between them. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.